Well, as the North Shore community mourns the loss of one of their senior football players, the Harris County Sheriff's Office is looking for the gunman who took his life. Yeah, Jarvon Coles was shot and killed Saturday night at a house party in Humble. Reporter Micah Hatfield has been looking into this today. She joins us live. Micah, what a heartbreaking story. Absolutely. There's no other way to say it other than this is a tragic loss for Jarvon, Jarvon Cole's family and his teammates here at North Shore High School. His family isn't ready to speak publicly yet, but they told me today that they are finding a little bit of comfort right now after learning that Jarvon was actually an organ donor and his life may save others. A lot of hard work and dedication. We start we start this since January. We just keep pushing and we go week by week treating every game the same. Jarvon Coles was a standout both on and off the football field at North Shore High School. He was ABC 13's Player of the Week back in September, not just because of what he was doing on the field, but what he did off of it as well. Yeah, I think he was ranked number 68 in his class out of 1,100-some students. He just lets you know when you got a kid that takes his academics so serious, it's going to be easy to coach a kid like that on the field. But tragedy struck his family and friends this weekend when Coles was shot at a house party in Humble. The sheriff's office says people at the party saw him on the ground and thought he was passed out. 911 was called to respond a couple of times to that home. Paramedics performed CPR on the high school senior, and that's when the sheriff's office says they realized he had actually been shot. We believe that at some point during the party, there was a car uh, occupied by multiple people uh, that drove by the location and fired several shots towards the party, striking our victim. The home where it happened on Fieldwick Lane is a short-term rental. We spoke over the phone with the homeowner, who says the home was rented to a mother who wanted to host a party for her son. That homeowner told ABC 13 they're going to have to be more careful who they rent to moving forward. Micah Hatfield, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.